Welcome to the lecture series of electronic principles and circuits. In this session, I'm going to discuss most important questions from module three. So I request everybody before going to the examination, kindly cover these kind of questions. Definitely th this can be expected for your UDST examination. So moving further, let us discuss individually. So the first question is, uh, derive the expression for output voltage of R to 2R resistor DAC. Okay, digital to analog converter, R to 2R DAC. Okay, so circuit diagram. Here, what is the requirement is, we need a neat circuit diagram. Okay, uh, then we have to go for like a, a voltage division formula. Then uh, ultimately, uh, we should know how to convert uh, the analog. So suppose we should have some uh, digital value like uh, 1001. Corresponding analog value, how, how will you compute? Okay, so that uh, you have to derive uh, using mathematical expression. The formulas are available. Kindly refer the material and you can uh, make it out. Second one is to explain the inverting and non-inverting configuration of summing amplifier. Okay. So you can uh, like uh, draw the inverting amplifier, then uh, non-inverting amplifier. Okay. Uh, then uh, like uh, summer. Okay. Uh, like uh, we have a different type of resistor R1, uh, then uh, R2, then R3. Okay. Then uh, one, uh, one terminal you are supposed to provide to, uh, if it is a non-inverting terminal, it has to be given to positive terminal. Inverting terminal should be given to ground. Then uh, how, what is output? Output of V0 will be equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3. Like that, you have to derive. Second one is called uh, what is zero crossing detector. The short form is ZCD. What is ZCD? Uh, you can make out a zero crossing detector using uh, op amp. Corresponding waveform also you are supposed to draw. I think I have shown you a numerical example and uh, theory, theory question in the previous year question paper discussion. Kindly refer that particular video. It's already available in my playlist. What you can do is you can directly go to the playlist of electronic principles and circuit and refer the previous year question paper. Definitely uh, same question I have mentioned already with the handwritten notes. You can refer this. Mention the demerits. Explain about the inverting comparator and the diode clamps. Okay. So all the questions want to ask, ask at a time, at least you can expect one, uh, two, these two questions you can expect at a time. Then build a comparator circuit. Build a comparator circuit to convert sine wave into square wave and uh, its linear region of typical comparator. <laughs> So you know that op amp will act as a comparator. So uh, from this uh, like a uh, triangular wave. So we have two inputs. One is a triangular uh, like uh, the sine wave. Sine wave will be available. So you need to convert sine wave into uh, sine wave with another waveform, and uh, the output should be square wave. So we have we'll have we will be having two inputs. Correct. One input should be sine wave. We need to select another input. Ultimately, you should get the output as a square wave. Duty cycle and all we can only decide. Okay. So uh, based upon that, you might have studied about the PWM technique, PWM. Same, same thing we are actually uh, considering, PWM. Okay. Yes. Now let's move on to the further slides. So please refer these particular uh, segments before going to the examination. Uh, you may get a numerical example as well. For example, those summer, summer circuit is available now. You may get the question. One diagram will be given. Uh, they may ask you to compute the output, the V0. X, what is the value of V0? Like that they may ask. Okay. That also you can expect because uh, uh, at a straight line, we cannot define. We cannot define how, what kind of questions will be asked. However, we can have an outsketch of uh, the overall uh, kind of question which is going to expect an examination. Develop how the comparator interfaces with the uh, analog and digital circuit and also explain the minimize the effect of input biasing current. Okay. That is a theory uh, like analytical type question, uh, which has the weightage of eight marks. At least you can expect it. Uh, explain the working of triangular wave generator circuit using Smith figure. Very, very important. Uh, and integrator method. Derive the expression for amplitude output to voltage and the frequency of triangular wave. Build the input output response of a hysteresis inverting Smith figure and a non inverting Smith figure. Most of the questions are theoretical type. More, you can expect more derivations, especially DAC. We have shown, we have already uh, shown in the first slide about uh, digital to analog converter, and that derivation is very important. And apart from that, a six, seven, eight, uh, these kind of questions also you can expect in the examination. Let me know if you have any queries. If you are watching our channel first time, I request you to uh, subscribe our channel. And if the video is useful, kindly share with others. And uh, also, uh, kindly put the bell button uh, for updating whenever we are updating the new video. Daily, we are updating one one video related to examination. Okay. Thank you so much for watching this video. Happy learning. Have a great day.